Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Lauren Wild. I'm a beach body coach and founder of Team Wild Republic. And today I just want to talk to you guys about eight myths or concerns that people typically have before they start to know anything or get any information about becoming a beach body coach. Um, what I want to do today is talk about eight common things that I think people think about when they're thinking about going into any kind of network marketing. But I want to talk a little bit about how the experience was different for me. Um, and how I saw all of these things to not be the case um, as far as Beachbody is concerned. So first I want to start out just by saying that I truly believe that there is no other network marketing company out there like Beachbody. Um, and a big reason why I believe that is because Number one, um, there's not another marketing company, network marketing company out there that provides the full package of what I call, um, you know, kind of like your your three vitals to getting yourself on a healthy lifestyle. Not just 30 days of losing weight or 60 days of losing weight, but actually creating a lifestyle. And those three things are dialed in fitness, which everybody knows the names now: P90X, Insanity, Max 30. 21 Day Fix, Pio, that's starting to be kind of a household names, and that's all Beachbody products. So we know that the results for the, all of those programs are amazing. Um, so we've got the dialed in fitness. We've got the dialed in nutrition. With all of those fitness programs are going to come a meal plan, recipes, um, you know, a, a breakdown of how to calculate how many calories you should be eating per day, how many um you know, proteins and fats and sugars. It's very detailed. Um, but then you also get the third portion of that is the accountability. And that's what people spend thousands of dollars a year um, on a trainer for. However, if you go to a trainer at a gym, it's very expensive and it's very hard to do it every single day unless you're a millionaire and someone can come to your house. Um, it's very hard to make that a routine and make that health and, and nutrition part of your lifestyle. Um, so I do not know of any network marketing company out there who can provide that lifestyle and that kind of coaching to that lifestyle other than Beachbody. There are companies that can provide pills and patches and stuff that can maybe, you know, get you skinny, skinny fat um, for a couple of months or so. And maybe that's what somebody is looking for at that time. I don't know. But what our program is designed to do is to create a lifestyle to help people make healthy choices every day, all the time, to help people get motivated to do the work and stay active for at least 30 minutes a day. Um, so for me personally, on that side of it, I really don't think there's another company out there where you can sell that. You can sell that energy and vitality and a lifestyle and not just products that are going to give you a quick fix. Um, so I think that's important to note. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and talk you guys through eight myths or eight concerns that people typically have before they become a beach body coach, or maybe they're a little bit interested, but they're like, well, my friend said this, or the internet said this. So as a personal, as, as a coach who's doing this and somebody that's worked in corporate for the last 10 years, who's very smart about business decisions. Um, I don't want to say I'm very smart, but you know, very savvy business savvy, um, I kind of want to address those things from my perspective and also from, I know, my other coaches' perspectives as well. So the first thing is, is Beachbody a pyramid scheme? <clears throat> so many people say that, or instead of asking that, I'll have so many people go, oh, that's what you're doing? Isn't that a pyramid scheme? Um, or, oh yeah, that pyramid scheme. So first of all, I want to say, it's not a pyramid scheme. First and foremost, pyramid schemes are illegal. Um, I would never be involved with something that's illegal in my life. Um, basically the whole basis of a pyramid scheme is that there's one person at the top. Um, there's one person at the top, the first person that got enrolled and the, the further you are to the bottom, the least chance you have to make any money or, um, <clears throat> see any kind of success because everything funnels up to the one person at the top. That is a true pyramid. Um, if you want to think of it, in another way, if you work for a corporate company, there's a CEO. You're never going to make more money than CEO. You're never going to have more ownership than the CEO. You will never pass the CEO in any corporate business unless they're fired. <clears throat> but um, it's going to be very difficult for you in your role to surpass the CEO or an owner of any type company. Um, we do not do it that way here in uh, Beachbody. What we do... <clears throat> 
excuse me, what we do is um, it really doesn't matter when you come into the company. I enrolled as a coach, and when I enrolled as a coach, week one, I surpassed the person that I enrolled under because they decided that they didn't have enough time to really dedicate to the business, and boom, I surpassed them. I've surpassed people above them. Um, you know, there's somebody who could enroll tomorrow in my team that could surpass me within a month. Um, so that's not really how this works. Your rank advancement and your money is never going to be tied to how much somebody above you makes ever. How we do structure it is that I do make a bonus, not taken from somebody else's um, commission, but that Beachbody pays me for building a team and having a lot of volume on my team. So that's how we make money. Um, based on our team. We do not make money taken from anyone else or a percentage of anyone else or anything like that. It's basically when you decide that you really want to help a bunch of people and you want to share the love of Beachbody and get more coaches on your team, then they get more coaches and more customers on their team and you create a ton of volume and Beachbody says, wow, thanks for creating so much volume. Here's a bonus based on the volume that you have within your team. So yes, there is levels, but you could jump people like crazy, I mean, within months, within a year, um, based on the level. So it doesn't matter who you enroll under. It doesn't matter what time you enroll in Beachbody. And I will say we're still a very young company on the team Beachbody side. We've only been around for about seven years. So um, this is still a really early time if you're getting in now. Um, and this is 2015. I know these videos can be time, time stamped, but um, it's 2015. So this is still a very early time and a very new new business model um, to be getting in, but it really doesn't matter. It's not about the time. I mean, our my upline coach, Brandy Botts, has been in this business for about three years, and it was is a superstar diamond, has gone crazy, and then there's people who've been in this business for seven years, and they're a two or three star diamond, or they're just keeping their distributorship. Um, so really, you guys, it's not at all a pyramid. We are not structured that way at all, um, but we are structured in a way to where um, it benefits us to really grow our community and grow our team. <clears throat> The next thing um, is, you know, the, or the next the next concern that people usually have is I'm not into sales. Um, and I totally get that. I did come from a sales background, but what I will say is this is something completely different. I know coaches personally that are super shy, that were auditors, accountants, people that were not salesy. They're just about facts and numbers and here's my job and I want to complete this task. And... Um, and they are some of the, the top earning coaches in this business. Um, so it's okay if you're not into sales. In fact, what I love about this business is that I get to choose who's on my team. You get to choose who's on your team. And I've actually turned people away. I've, I have started to see that it's about quality and not quantity. And, you know, I've, I've heard to, and talked to people who are like, I'm going to kill it. I'm going to make more than anyone on your team. I'm such a salesperson. And my response to that is that's not really what we're about at all. We're not about that as a company. We're not about that as a team. We literally are about helping other people to a healthy lifestyle. And that is my core focus every single month. I don't think of people as a number or as a point or as money. I think of people as, oh my gosh, I just helped that person lose 30 pounds last month. Like that is why I do this business. And that's why anybody who's thinking about becoming a coach, that should be part of why you're doing this. Not to make buku bucks at the beginning, but to truly help people and to truly love what you're doing every day and, and love that this is what brings you, you know, success. And this is what brings you, a, makes you a living that you get to help people every single day. So I, you do not have to be a salesperson. A really, really great thing to note though, is that, um, we have so many trainings and tips and trips tricks that have been passed down from my team. And just for you guys to know, Brandy Botts is my star diamond upline, which means she's um, the closest star diamond coach to me in my team and to you and your team. But we are also like a descendant of Janelle Summers, who is the top, um, I think she's a top ranking coach in all of Beachbody. Um, she's actually Shalene Johnson, who created Pio Turbofire. It's her sister. So if anybody 
has the trainings, it's Janelle. And that was passed down from her coaches to Mindy Winder, which was passed down to Brandy, which is passed down to us. So um, you don't have to be a top crazy salesperson. You just have to have all the tools to be able to share this with people. And you do have that within our team. So I just want you to be comfortable about that. Um, the third concern that people usually say is, you know what? I'm not a health and fitness junkie. I'm just not. You totally don't have to be. If it is important to you to, ha to have and live a healthy lifestyle, and it's important to you for your family and your kids to live a healthy lifestyle, um, then this is something that will be for you. You know, I mean, there are certainly coaches in Beachbody that are nutritionists or are instructors and just thought, oh, this is another great way for me to spread the message of what I love and what I'm passionate about. Um, but you certainly don't have to. And I think what's so great about this business is I don't market myself as a trainer or an expert in this business because I'm not. I'm just a, you know, a single working mom who um, really is interested in feeding my kid the right things, feeding my body the right things, you know, being healthy. Um, Shakeology was a huge game changer for me because I was always focused on just being skinny and then I started realizing the health changes that I experienced by drinking Shakeology every day. Um, so that is so relatable when you're talking to other people is that like, look, I'm just, I'm just like you, you know, and, um, I want to motivate you to get your workout in today. I'm just like you. I'm a mom. I eat my kids' food all the time. Sometimes I have, you know, a birthday month where I go crazy and I gain 10 pounds. You know, I'm just like you. Um, and I think that those make the best coaches. There's a couple coaches I would tell you to uh, check out. Um, Meg Wazinski and um, Carly Del Carlo. God, she's so inspiring. But they have such a message of, I'm just like you. I'm just a normal girl, you know. They don't look like they're about to go enter a bikini competition, but they look great. They look healthy. Um, same for me. I look at me like I don't look like I'm going to go be all ripped up and go enter a bikini competition. But, you know, I kept the, the pounds off that I wanted to keep off since I started Beachbody. And I'm happy about that. Um, and that's all that this is really about. <clears throat> okay, so the fourth concern that people have, and this is the one that I probably thought the most when I first started getting started, when I first started getting started, when I when I first um, thought about this, was I don't have the time. Um, let me tell you guys, I am a single mom. Um, my child's father lives in another country and is only here maybe like once every three months to see him for a weekend. So I don't have a lot of help there. <clears throat> Excuse me. I work full time. Um, and I have my son and he goes to daycare, but then he's here with me. Um, and so I get it. I was the same way. I was like, I don't have the time to do this. But I think the thing was, is that it was so exciting to me that I was seeing changes in myself and, or even, even when I first started that I was going to get to see changes that I was kind of like, oh my gosh, go on this journey with me guys. Like I'm going to change. I'm going to commit to this. And I, it, that was so exciting for me. I was just sharing it. And people got so excited and they were like, oh my gosh, I want to commit to this too. This is so exciting that I looked forward to my beach body time, like at my desk in my corporate job, because I was just like, this is so fun. I'm connecting with people. I'm building community. I'm sharing this with people. I'm helping them, you know, and it was kind of like my me time. So I didn't see it as like my beach body power hour. I saw it as like, okay, I'm going to sneak away and get to work on beach body right now because that's what was just so fulfilling to me. Like I loved it. And then when I saw like a $550 paycheck my first week, I was like, there might be something to this. Um, so I just would encourage you guys, if you can do this, I know, um, another coach who she was the same thing, had a really full plate and her coach coach told her who was already very successful in the business. Don't worry. You can make a fortune doing this, doing it part-time. And that is so true. I mean, I have more time. I work from home now, but I still do it part time. I don't spend every waking minute on my beach body business. I don't. Um, and there's ways that you can really dial in and focus your energy towards certain behaviors to where you're making really good use of your time. You could literally do this for three hours a day and talk to 10 people a day and your business could skyrocket. Um, so don't worry about that. And if you want to, when you're getting started, you could do it from one hour a day. And I've seen some coaches that say, you know what? 
I can only do it one hour, and I'm going to have to split that up over 20-minute increments. But that 20 minutes is dialed in, distraction-free, and they work their business and they kill it. So it's really about, you know, the time, as far as time, if you can really learn how to plan your time and be focused within your time, you don't need a ton of time to be very successful in this business. And that's what we're here for. I'm going to give you tips and tricks on how to plan your time, how to focus your time and energy when you do block out some time for this business. And you're going to be amazed at what you're going to see from that. Um, the fifth uh, thing that people usually get worried about is I'm not at my goal weight. I've even had a lot of coaches join as coaches and excited to tell people about Shakeology and the workouts, but they're like, but I can't run a challenge group. Look at me. Like, I'm not at my goal weight. That is so silly, guys. People don't relate to that. That's exactly why you guys started a challenge group with me instead of, you know, Jillian Michaels, you know, who's super fit and ripped. You know, it's people relate to she's doing it. She's a single mom. She works. She lost like 15 pounds working out at home. That sounds like something I can do. You know, um, I fall off. I eat pizza sometimes. I eat ice cream sometimes. People relate to that. They're like, so do I. And I don't want to be looking like I'm in a capine, hello, bikini competition every day. You know, I don't. I want to have a healthy balance of fun and health, you know. So you really do not need to be your goal weight. There's lots of ways that you can go about this. But really, I think that is something that is just, an insecurity that people feel, and I definitely understand that, but I will tell you, you just do not need to be. Again, follow Meg Wazinski, follow Carly Del Carlo. Um, Meg Wazinski is actually, this is July 2015, but she is pregnant right now, and she is working it out, honey, and she has gained a lot of weight. She's pregnant, you know, but she is doing the work. She is eating healthy. She's teaching Turbo Jam at like 32 weeks pregnant. It's amazing, and that is so relatable. You're like, okay, if you're pregnant, you're like, I'm going to pull it together. I'm going to try to do it. Meg was doing it, you know, so it's just about being relatable. Also, this is about the journey. And that's what I said earlier when I said we give people, you know, dialed in fitness, dialed in nutrition and accountability to create a lifestyle. It's about the journey. It's not about the final product. Like we don't want to say like, do this with me for 45 days and get totally ripped. And then I don't know, I left you and I don't know what happened to you and get fat, get skinny. I don't care. You know, get unhealthy, get healthy. No, it's a lifestyle and it's a journey. And so you can say that too. Like I'm still on my journey. Like, you know, I'm right now trying to kind of cut weight and tone, but then in a couple months from now, I might not be, I might be like, you know what? I just, I'm really busy. I just want to eat healthy, get my workouts in and whatever will be, will be, you know? So it's a journey. So remember that you don't have to be at this. And I think that's the other thing. If you think of it as a final product and not a journey, um, you're never going to think you're at your goal weight. You're never going to think you're tight and ripped enough to be able to, you know, go ahead and do this. And you are, you're relatable right now. Okay. So the sixth concern that people have is I am not connected to enough people. Um, I will tell you guys right now, excuse me. I was not connected. I think I was connected to like 400 people on Facebook last year. And now I'm connected to like 1,500 people um, just by adding people, getting, you know, um, networking on Facebook, that kind of thing. So you do not need to be connected to people. There is a top, top coach in this business. I'm just going to say her name, Mindy Winder, that lives on like, I forget what she calls it, but it's like a very, very remote area of like the Midwest. And I think she has like the amount of people in her town or the amount of people in her state or like the amount of people in like a pretty small like Texas or Louisiana town or something. So she had like no one to network with and she knew most of the people in her town and she just did everything 100% from social media. Another thing to note is in her town, I think her best friend and sister or something and her mom are all doing Beachbody too. And so clearly they're not pulling from their town. They're pulling from the people that are like them. So that's what we do is by having a business on social media, you find people that are like you, that maybe you're in the same life experience. Maybe you're both divorced with kids. Maybe you're both um, married with three kids and juggling all of that. Um, maybe you don't have any kids and you and your husband are struggling with infertility. There are so many coach stories that they have built so many connections with women through that and built them onto their teams. And now they get to work with them every day. And like, just what a blessing that is. It's just amazing to see like what God does in, in those areas, like to share that and be vulnerable and find other people struggling 
with the exact same thing and then build a friendship out of that and then a business partner out of that. Like it's amazing. So that's how we share on social media is in that way is finding people like us and just reaching out and talking and saying, Hey, how are you? Um, so yeah, so that's that. Um, the seventh thing is I can't afford it. And I'm just going to blanket statement this. You can't afford not to. I'm telling you right now, you can't afford not to, because if you follow our trainings week one, you're going to be making back what you invested. I need, I need food because it's have such a small investment. Um, so I just want to let you guys know that it's like $140 for a challenge pack. You're going to be getting the best nutrition of your life, an amazing program that you're going to be able to follow and see amazing results. And then every three people that you add per month pays for your Shakeology and your program. So you guys, I mean, they're really, I've never paid for my product in Beachbody ever. I've been doing this six months. I've never paid for it. I've always made much more money than what my Shakeology per month was or what my initial investment was. So I just want to put that out there. Also, um, there are a couple coaches you can look up that literally fi had to file bankruptcy um, that were just struggling so bad. Last year's top coach, Lindsay Matway, um, had a baby that was um, that was sick and had crazy hospital bills when she was born. And they had so many hospital bills. They, I think they had to foreclose on their house. They had to go into bankruptcy. It was crazy. She was a bartender. And that was all she knew. And she focused and did this consistently. You guys, right now, if you look up Lindsay Matway on YouTube, she is a light. I will tell you right now. She Not only is she so successful, but she is because she's a light. She knew she could do this. She's motivated and inspired so many of her coaches to do the same. Um, there's a couple other coaches that come to mind. Andrea Crowder on uh, Misfit Republic. They were really struggling um, money-wise, that kind of thing. Um, an amazing coach on our team and directly connected to Brandy, Lauren Majewski. Their house burnt down. They were homeless. Um, and her thought was kind of like, you know what? I can't afford not to do this. Um, so I would, I would tell you from a health and fitness perspective, you can't afford not to do it because literally signing up to be a Beachbody coach just means you're going to be drinking the most amazing shake every day for your body and it is going to change your health and your vitality and the way you feel so tremendously. I can't say that enough. Um, and then financially, you guys, the sky is the limit. I mean, from bankrupt to, yeah, Lindsay Matway makes over a million dollars a year now. Um, you know, same with a couple of our other coaches that I mentioned, um, at least making in like the 500,000. So, I mean, you guys, it is amazing. Like, um, this is just something that honestly, I just don't know why everyone doesn't do this. Like if you want to spread love and light and you want that to be your full-time job, this is the job for you. I mean, you definitely can afford it. I promise you. Um, and the very last thing is I don't know what to do. And we hear that a lot and that is totally fine. Of course you don't know what to do. Like, why would you ever know what to do? And I think people think that because when you go to school for something for a job or, you know, you're moving from one job to the next job, you were kind of trained on that, on what to do and how to navigate. Well, that's exactly what we're going to do here in our team. Like I mentioned earlier, we have all the templates, all the scripts, um, all these amazing trainings from Beachbody, from podcasts, from all the um, stuff that I've learned and all the stuff that people above me have learned and passed on to me, you guys. You guys are going to get access to all of that. Um so that's just what I'm here for. And, and to be honest with you, as a coach, you'll see as you start building your team, you start to kind of focus more on leading and helping people and, you know, understand how to start a challenge group or how to talk to people or how to build relationships and that kind of thing. So that's what I'm here for. That's what our upline is here for. And let me tell you, our upline is so killer. I know I mentioned them before. Um, Aaron Whaley is somebody that did not have to help me at all in this business. He was not my personally sponsored coach. He stepped in and acted like my personally sponsored coach. Just an amazing man. Um, does amazing uh, for me and for everyone on his team. He's with Blue Bayou. Um, his team is Team Blue Bayou Fitness. Um, and he is a personally sponsored coach, or Brandy is his coach. Um, so that's how I got hooked up with her. So I just want to let you guys know that um, not every team has this um, community behind it. Even if you're on a really amazing coaches team, you might be very far down in their downline and you might sign up under someone that's really not connected and doesn't know how to get to connected. And um, this is a great place. You're very connected here. Um, we've got 
Facebook groups for TKO, Brandy's team, for me, uh, for Blue Bayou, that you can stay connected. Um, we give you updates, tips, so you guys can know that you will be super connected with everything going on at Beachbody. Um, you will not have to worry that you're going to not have an answer for somebody new. You're not going to have to worry that because you're new, you're not going to know what to say to someone. The beauty of this business is you can say, you know what, I am so new and I don't know, but isn't awesome. I have my upline coach where I can go ask and I'll get right back to you. You would have the help of them too. You know, so um, it's just great. You guys, I love doing this. I love sharing these things with you. Um, I would sit here and tell you that these are eight myths or um, crazy concerns that have now been debunked, I hope. I hope that you're seeing, there's like a fly in here. I hope that you're seeing that too now. Um, and I hope that you guys are ready to get started and ready to join my team. Bye guys.